have a look on this problem. Find two consecutive positive numbers. Sum of four squares is 613. This is the information given in the question. First, what are the what is the meaning of consecutive positive numbers? Consecutive positive numbers means that number and its next number is called consecutive positive numbers. For example, 16 and 17, 100 and 101. Okay, 1000 and 1001. Like this, continuous numbers are called that number and the next number is called consecutive positive numbers. Now, let us assume the two numbers are. Let us assume the two numbers. Two numbers are first number I am assuming as x. Then the next number will be x plus 1. The next number, that number and that next number or consecutive numbers, consecutive numbers. So first number if I take as x, then the next number will be x plus 1. Sum of whose squares, sum of whose squares is equal to 613. Squares, first number square is x square. Second number square is x plus 1 whole square. Sum of whose squares, sum plus I am doing addition. Sum of whose squares is equal to 613. Now simplify this x square. This x plus 1 whole square again in the form of a plus b whole square. This I have to expand in the form as a square plus b square plus 2ab. In this, it is x plus 1 is in the form of a plus b. X, a, x plus 1 whole square is in the form of a plus b whole square. Based on this formula, I am expanding this x plus 1 whole square. Here, x is a, 1 is b. So, first a square, that is x square, plus b square, 1 square. 1 square means it is 1. 2ab. 2 into x, 2x, 2x into 1, again 2x is equal to 613. x square plus x square, that is 2x square plus 2x plus 1. Bring the 613 to left side, so other side will be equal to 0. Now, 2x square plus 2x. 1 minus 613 that is minus 612 one is plus symbol other one is minus symbol the two symbols are different different so that i am subtracting 601 uh, from the 613 the big number sign is minus always the result is the big number sign will come to the answer uh, result so that 1 minus 613 is equal to minus 613 is equal to 0 now 2x square plus 2x minus 612 is equal to 0. Now every term is having 2. See 2x square, 2x, it is also multiple of 2. So I can divide every, every term by 2 to make it simple form by 2, by 2 and by 2. Okay, 3, 0, 3, 0, 6. So finally the equation will become like, comes like this. x square plus x minus 306 is equal to 0. Now this problem came to quadratic equation form. Now let us simplify this quadratic equation in the, by using the quadratic equation formula b square minus 4ac by 2a. Here again I am writing a is equal to 1, b is also 1, c is minus 306. a is 1, b is 1 and c is, c means constant, it is minus 306. Now substitute the values. 
ओके ए वैल्यू इज माइनस वन बी इज माइनस वन सी इज माइनस थ्री नॉट सिक्स आई एम सब्सिट्यूटिंग दीज थ्री वैल्यूज इन द कॉरेट इक्वेशन सो एक्स इज इक्वल टू माइनस बी दट इज माइनस वन प्लस आर माइनस रूट बी स्क्वे बी स्क्वे इज वन वन स्क्वे फोर ए सी फोर इंटू वन एंड माइनस थ्री नॉट सिक्स इट विल बी इट इज ट्वेल्व हंड्रेड एंड ट्वेंटी फोर बाय टू ए बाय टू इंटू वन इज इक्वल टू माइनस वन प्लस आर माइनस रूट ट्वेल्व हंड्रेड एंड ट्वेंटी फोर प्लस वन दट इज ट्वेल्व हंड्रेड एंड ट्वेंटी फाइव बाय टू इज इक्वल टू माइनस वन प्लस आर माइनस स्क्वेर रूट ऑफ ट्वेल्व ट्वेंटी फाइव इज इक्वल टू थर्टी फाइव बाय टू इज इक्वल टू माइनस वन प्लस आर माइनस थर्टी फाइव बाय टू वन टाइम आई हैव टू टेक प्लस सिंबल नेक्स्ट टाइम माइनस सिंबल सो माइनस वन प्लस थर्टी फाइव इज इक्वल टू थर्टी फोर बाय टू आर माइनस थर्टी सिक्स बाय टू सेवेंटीन आर माइनस एटीन बट इन द क्वेश्चन क्लियरली मेन्शन द टू कॉन्सेक्यूटिव पॉजिटिव नंबर्स सो द एक्स वैल्यू मस्ट बी पॉजिटिव इट शुड नॉट बी नेगेटिव सो आई एम अवॉइडिंग आई एम रिमूविंग दिस माइनस एटीन आई एम टेकिंग एक्स एज द सेवेंटीन सो एक्स वैल्यू इज सेवेंटीन इट्स नेक्स्ट नंबर एक्स प्लस वन इज इक्वल टू सेवेंटीन प्लस वन दट इज एटीन The two numbers are seventeen and eighteen. Okay, one second. Take a overview. Let us assume the two numbers are x and x plus one. The next condition is given: sum of four squares. Sum of four squares means x square root plus x plus one whole square. Sum of these two squares is equal to six hundred and thirteen. After that, I expanded x plus four whole square by, according to this formula, two x x square plus x square two x square, two x is two x one plus one and six hundred minus uh, it will come minus when I am sending this six thirty to the left side it will become minus. So in the next case, next step, two x square plus two x one minus six hundred thirteen will become six hundred and tall is equal to zero. Okay. it is looking to very big expression large numbers are there but every number is a multiple of 2 so that i divided every term by 2 so that i am getting equation x square plus x minus 306 by using the quadratic equation formula i simplified this i simp i substituted the a b c value in the quadratic equation when i am substituting these values in the quadratic equation formula i am getting x value as 17 the x plus 1 the next number is 18 so that the two numbers are 17 and 18 here remember 17 and minus 18 i am getting as x value but i am not taking minus number why because in the question itself mentioned positive integers so i took only 17 The first number is seventeen. The next number is eighteen. The two numbers are seventeen and eighteen. Okay.